This is one delivery that Russ Adams has waited for more than a year to arrive. Last summer when gas was $4 a gallon, you know, it gets you thinking about, is there another alternative to this? So Adams found an alternative, now packed inside this large cardboard box. Production was just starting on Bramo's 100% electric motorcycle when Adams put his name on a waiting list. Then a few weeks ago, he got an email that one of the first bikes was ready for delivery if he was still interested. I thought about it for about 20 minutes and then pulled the trigger and, and did it. And Adams had no regrets as the bike was rolled off the truck and into his driveway. But it was the feeling of getting on the motorcycle for the first time and taking it for a ride that really had him sold. Yeah, that's incredible. Wow. There's, there's very few things that I ride or drive where I just have a grin that I can't wipe off my face. Yeah. And that is, it's also hard not to smile knowing he'll never have to fill it with gas. He can just plug it in and the bike's range will be perfect for his commute from Huxley to Ames. I can go there and come back and still have plenty of range to you know, go to a grocery store or you know, stop by a friend's house or something. It's maneuverable. It doesn't just have to be parked out on the street. You could wheel it into your house, into your business, um, into the break room at work, charge it. No gas, no emissions, no required maintenance. And listen. Yes, that's crickets you hear because there's no rumble from the engine. Yeah, I mean, if I need to leave at 5 o'clock in the morning, my neighbors aren't even going to know I'm going because it's completely silent. But they'll definitely see him taking his new toy out for a spin. This is going to be like Christmas morning, you know, when you take the remote control car, you use it till the battery goes dead, and then you charge it up, and you use it again. 